cuts are made and most of the lumber is upstairs in the uh, on the model table except for that board right there I gotta rip that one that'll be the last cut and uh, I should mention something here and that is this that yesterday I was showing you something that was not a good idea it is not a good idea to plunge and pull with a saw like this it, uh, it uh, I got a very slight catch on my very first cut nothing nothing serious no, it wasn't a big bang or anything like that it just that it got a little bit of a catch just enough to startle me and uh, my air conditioners just kicked in so I hope you can still hear me uh, yeah I, uh, it's not a good idea to do that so uh, forget that I showed you that that's my disclaimer <laughs> anyway uh, let's just uh, get things rearranged here and we'll rip this board it went it went pretty good otherwise and and, and that actually that that catch it wasn't really a catch it was just enough to remind me uh, hey what's what you're doing I got some uh, really nice uh, nice leftovers there I don't know what I'll do with it they're all a little bit uh, too short I was thinking maybe it would make a good base to put under the model of the hood but they're all, all a little bit too short so oh maybe in time I'll find something it's it's really nice lumber speaking of lumber remind me to uh, tell you something about lumber when we get upstairs to the model table and I can sit down I'm just gonna rearrange everything and we'll cut this one piece and then we'll go upstairs and one-eighth of an inch wide if I want to rip it right up the middle here I'm going to want to set my blade so that the center of the of the teeth would be what would that be half of eleven is five and a half half of an eighth is a sixteenth so it would be five and nine sixteenths that sound right i'll put the center of the blade at five and nine sixteenths here i'm almost there i'm not going to stick my macro lens on to show you okay five and nine sixteenths to the center all right we're locked in place here all being well that should work out twice cut once okay five and a half plus a sixteenth that ah, should be pretty good I haven't used this thing for so long I almost forgot how I have to think all, all the way my process all the way through again
Here is something I was not expecting. Okay. I guess I'll just get this glued up off camera here. Um, yeah, I, I sure wasn't expecting this. Not like I dropped it or something, it just... I guess some sort of uh, contraction was going on there in the drying process and when I... when I split the board, the... Uh, some sort of forces took over. Anyway, I'm just going to do this off camera, fix it up. In the meantime, we've got one good one here. Take it upstairs and I think it's coffee time anyway. Cheers! Now, speaking of cheers, that's a common expression in Australia, and I've been recently informed that in Australia they don't call this lumber, they call it timber. Well, here in Canada, we call it lumber. To us, timber is the trees standing in the forest that can potentially be turned into first of all logs then milled into lumber and lumber will it could be oh uh, you know it could be posts it could be beams it could be two by fours or it could be boards but it'll be lumber um, yeah you don't very often see this uh, uh, set up without my lights on usually I've got my my overhead lights on so that it illuminates the the model and everything but I'm just using the light coming in the windows here and I hope you can see it good enough here that that cross bracing that you see there that's got to be lowered because I want to be able to lay the uh, the case across the table and have the end sticking out there oh all of that's got to those, those boxes and everything that's all got to come out the my intention is that the the uh, model case is going to stand against that wall there. Uh, that, that's that's the plan. It's about it's either that or it's going to have to be back in one of the other rooms because there's there's no room around here anywhere. Uh, my living room and is just a, an unbelievable mess. You know when you live all by yourself and you just let things go. Uh, yeah, I think we had a discussion like this about a year or so ago. Anyway, I've uh, got to clean everything up here. I'm going to take all the small stuff off of the table here so that when I'm swinging stuff around, I'm not going to be knocking it onto the floor or breaking something. Um, that's the plan. May not happen today. Uh, oh, there's one more thing that I want to show you. Well, maybe that'll be tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I, I was noticing there was a, a label on the ends of these boards here, and I just, I just want to copy down what it says on it in Google and find out you know exactly what it's talking about here but there there is a, a little label on the on the on these boards well that'll have to be tomorrow it's it's not really that late it's only uh, 1230 uh, but I'm, I'm getting kind of tired so uh, yeah thanks for watching and all being well We'll see you tomorrow.